Are you ready to stop the self-sabotage and create the life you desire? Well, in order for that to happen, you need to break free from the bad beliefs that are holding your success hostage. You need to optimize the stress by turning it into extra energy for success. And those hurtful habits? Well, we need to give that pain a purpose for progress. Welcome to Stop the Self-Sabotage and Create the Life You Desire podcast. So whenever you decide to break a bad habit in your life, it might be stopping smoking or overeating, losing your temper with the kids, unless you have teenagers, can't help you there. Um, But anything where you feel like you're just not being your best, the law of substitution says that you have to choose what you want to replace the habit with. As a certified hypnotist and instructor, I train others to become hypnotherapists. This is something very important that we just can't take out one thing without choosing what else is going to go in its place because the subconscious mind, once it's accepted a habit or pattern, it won't tolerate a void. This is the reason why people who decide to stop smoking on their own typically go to overeating. So the law of substitution at its basic form says you trade out one for another. So decide what you want to replace the bad habit with. But in our business, that's not enough. Because it's not actions that we're replacing it with. It's an identity. See, you had an identity that when you started smoking, it's because you wanted to be able to fit in and be with the cool crowd. Or be a leader, be one of the first kids to start smoking. Whatever the original reason was, you just use the cigarettes or the overeating to soothe yourself or the sugars to pump yourself up or the anger to say a boundary has been violated. You use that as a tool to help define your identity. Well, that identity isn't going to change. We just need to upgrade how you're getting it met. So if you started smoking because you wanted to be one of the cool kids, you're still one of the cool kids by bringing out the part of your identity that can have you being your healthiest. If you overeat the carbs to soothe yourself, now you're learning to nurture yourself in ways that is even better because you're not relying on an outside substance, which is another reason why we teach all of our clients self-hypnosis, how to do this for themselves. Anger, a boundary has been violated. How about if you step into that leadership and say, I don't have to lose my temper in order to have conversations with others where we can explore how we can proceed together. So it's a identity upgrade is what is going to be transferred out. You had an identity that had to be reliant on something outside of you to be okay. Well, now it's time to be empowered. All the pieces are bringing back home to you. And that's what you should be doing is the law of substitution. No longer dependent upon anything outside of you to be your very best. And if I can ever assist you in this identity upgrade, reach out to me. 636-699-7791. And even if I'm not the one to work with you, I'll give you the questions you should be asking when you interview others to see if they're a good fit. So the law of substitution Use it to upgrade your identity or it'll use you just for exchanging one bad habit for another. So until we get together again, be brilliant.